finally, we come to Shirley Downs, dun, dun, dun. the second victim of our unknown perpetrator, a completely innocent bystander the night that Charlotte May was taken, the perfect alibi. Perhaps you'd like a cup of tea, Mr. Conway. It's two sugars, isn't it? Uh, yes, that's right. Please, How? Make yourself at home. Oh, no. How does he know? Hi, hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to Conway Disappearance and Daily of You. Today we are gonna play the last chapter of this game. So this video is gonna be the last video for this series. I really love them, I hope you enjoy them as well and I just really want to see what's going on so let's just start immediately because I can't wait anymore. The accusation! Okay, who are we gonna accuse? All of them. They, they are I all... was reaching the end of my investigation. Oh. No idea if Catherine could even look me in the eye. I'd promised Tony Morgan I'd find his daughter. And I'd betrayed my own in the process. Perhaps I should have listened to Catherine and left the investigation to the police. Perhaps Tony Morgan didn't need my help. Perhaps I'd failed everyone. Aww. Only time would tell. Shirley Downs held the key. Hmm. Oh. Catherine, thank you for coming. What do you want, Dad? I told you I didn't want to I go promise this. I'm not wasting your time. What do you want? Please, I hope so. come inside. I have something <laughs> you'll want to see. You'll forgive me if I don't believe you. What then the hell? why did you come? It's my job to follow up all leads. Then, okay, please, then go inside. I'll show you what I've been working on these past few days. These past few days you promised me you weren't investigating again. Yeah. Please don't humiliate me, Dad. Okay. <gasps> oh, no. He's gonna humiliate her. <laughs> Thank you all for coming. I imagine you share some notion why I asked you here. Oh, shit. In short, to discuss the disappearance of Charlotte May, and also to apologize to each and every one of you. I'm sure you know by now that oh, I've been investigating every possible area of her disappearance, and that has meant looking closely at Daily View. You mean spying on us? A yeah, crude that's what I mean. Yes. That's illegal. Uh, surely. I've you don't talk. broken no laws. Uh, I can assure you. That we know of? Shut this up. an invasion of privacy. You're a police officer. How can you let him do this? It's not illegal to ask questions, Mrs. McKee. What about breaking and entering? Let's <laughs> that. Hey? Are you pressing charges, Mr. Levy? Because we can as well. We still need to address the fact that there's an attacker at let large. Let Mr. Conway speak. <laughs> I'd rather like to see where this is going. Hmm. Well, uh, with my apology out of the way, let's talk about what I've uncovered. Ah, can I say about Annabelle? Please, just let me say about Annabelle. The Marquis, the Marquis. Annabelle and Theo. Bitch. The two of you clearly have problems of your own to work through. The very nerve of you, Mr. Cole. And Shut you up. should have reported that dog that you hit with the car. It would have saved a lot of time. Perhaps we would have found Charlotte May by now. But I have no reason at all to think you could have taken Charlotte May. But I told you that if you'd ask. I have nothing more to say to the two of you. No, I have. I need to say. Harold Levy. Ah, uh, uh, you don't like me very much. Oh. I can live with that. You said it yourself. As long as I pay my rent on time, we won't have a problem. In the future, it might do you well to extend that courtesy to neighbors going through certain hardships. Hmm. But not every problem can be solved with your fists. I believe you owe Mr. Morgan an apology. What's he talking about? About attacking him. Other than that, I found nothing to think you capable of such a terrible act as kidnapping a girl. I have nothing more for you. Oh, that was a waste of time then. Shut up. Lady Doa. You're an I angel. Thank you for 
for permitting me to search your home. Yeah, you're so but sweet. on reflection, you really should pay more attention to whom you employ mm -hmm. to clean your estate. Hmm. Hindsight is a blessing. I don't <laughs> think you had anything to do with Charlotte May's disappearance. It's a shame that your home was violated in such a uh -huh. Again, I extend my apologies that you've been dragged into this. Water under the bridge, Mr. Conway. Hmm. And finally, we come to Shirley Downs. Dun, dun, dun. The second victim of our unknown perpetrator. A completely innocent hmm. bystander the night that Charlotte May was taken. The perfect alibi. Were it not all based on lies and deception? Well, then. What? No, you. You all saw what happened. To Shirley, me. please. Let mm. us dispense with the song and dance. Shirley? What is he talking mm. about? I have no idea, Annabelle. I can assure you of that. Just what on earth are you getting at, Mr. Conway? <laughs> I bloody know it. You've always been a dark horse. Shut up. I have nothing to do with Charlotte May's disappearance, I promise you. Mr. Conway, I think you might have made a mistake. Catherine, would you mind? Please, I think it's time we talk to Miss Downs alone. Could we have the room? I, I think I should stay. She's my sister and she needs Mrs. my... Mrs. McKee. Shut please. up and go. Everyone, in fact, leave now. I think it's best you leave too, Mr. Morgan. Don't worry, I'll update you later on this evening. Shirley, I... I'll be fine, Annabelle. They're making a huge mistake. Maybe. As the police officer said. I'm afraid that means you too, Mr. Levy. No way. I would have missed this if you paid me. Get out, you fool. <laughs> I love you. This is what you wanted, was it? What the... F Huh? How very disappointing. Good work, Mr. Conway. Thank you. Shirley, please take a seat. Is there any way I can do this wrong? Or it no. doesn't matter? Like... Where should I begin? Look, I, I don't know what <laughs> this is about, but I think you made a huge mistake. Shut up. I'm sorry. Catherine, is it? Can you talk some sense into him? I think we should hear what he has to say. <sighs> this is ridiculous. If you have nothing to hide, then surely mm -hmm. you would relish the chance to prove your innocence. You watched uh -huh. me get attacked. That proves that the kidnapper is still out there. Oh. There were two. Let's start there, then, Maybe. shall we? Uh, this one first. What's that supposed to be? Well, what you stole? Why did you tell me? It was found in your pub. So what? Lots of people drink there every day. Glasses smash. I don't know what's special about a piece of glass. The it is mm. your spy glass. That sounds plausible. Spy thingy. Well, there you have it. Well, then what? Mr. Crow didn't seem to think so. He told me you took it from the police evidence room. <laughs> Prove it. I intend to. I'm sure Mr. Crow will be willing to testify. Hmm. Let's move on. How will you explain this, <laughs> I wonder? Perhaps you want to explain how you found that, without breaking the law. Uh, well, uh, I'm sure it will come to that. <laughs> but for now, we're talking about you. You have nothing to say. La, 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 la. There's no getting around this, Shirley. <sighs> You're not listening. It wasn't me. Okay, then say who it was. It's all the fucking what photo. You have to say about this? You, you've been watching me. Of course. Annabelle was right. This is an invasion of privacy. Well, isn't that what you wanted? What are you talking about? Well, for someone to see your charade. Well, this the whole business with the so-called <laughs> intruder. You set the whole thing up. Maybe she what didn't. What a ridiculous thing to say. How yes. could I have? Why would I? <coughs> you did it so that Tony Morgan would see you as the victim, and therefore not as his attacker. <coughs> I saw you too. I'll admit, mm. you were very convincing. 
This is all in your mind, Mr. Conway. You... you have no evidence at all. Well... I have, actually. Let's <coughs> continue, shall we? <laughs> well... I suppose that's that. Catherine, is what you've heard enough to arrest Miss Downs? I see. Mm, no. Not conclusive enough, I'm afraid. Well, then. I suppose I was wrong. I should what? have gone with my gut and accused Annabelle. Ah, uh, he's gonna Again, do I'm that. Sorry the, your time. Yeah. Catherine. He's gonna do it like that. Because she knows Wait, she loves Mr. Conway. Here. What could you possibly think Annabelle has to do with this? Well, I shouldn't discuss this with you, but all those late nights whilst Thea was gigging, no one able to verify her whereabouts. And then, of course, there's the matter of the, uh, well, Deferred. like I said, I shouldn't discuss this with you. Uh, I apologize, Miss Downs. But let's see if we have enough to arrest your sister. Wait. <laughs> what is it? I hid the telescope in my safe, but I was yeah. hiding it for someone else. The truth, Shirley. All this conversation is over. Okay, I hit Mr. Morgan, but I swear I thought he was someone else. I'll see oh. what your sister has to say about that. I'm telling you the truth. Annabelle had nothing to do with it. Where is Charlotte May? I didn't take her. <laughs> That's why I hid the telescope in the first place. So the police wouldn't suspect that I took her. That uh -huh. makes no sense whatsoever. I didn't no, take it does. Charlotte May. So, let me get this straight. And it's very important that you're clear. You took the shard of glass from the police evidence room. Well, well yes, because it proved that I hit mm -hmm. Mr. Morgan. But I thought I was hitting Harold Levy. The telescope is the attack weapon. Yeah. I... Uh, I took it from Lady Dewa's hallway. Mm -hmm. I saw my sister having an affair from Lord Dewa's window. Choo! I was angry. I, I... I overreacted. You attacked Tony Morgan. I already told you. I thought I was hitting Harold Levy. He was kissing my sister, Annabelle. Yeah. A married woman. Theo's wife. Whoopsie. I didn't do anything. You faked the attack against you. Yes. Hmm. I needed people to know that the kidnapper is still out there. I couldn't come forward and say what I'd done because people would think I took Charlotte May. Well, yeah. I don't think even you can separate the truth from the lies anymore. I'm not lying, Mr. Conway. You took Charlotte May that night. I did not. Then you put her in Lady Doa's basement. <laughs> Why? I'm not saying another word. You knocked me from my chair and then staged the attack on yourself to throw me off the scent. <laughs> That's all in your head. Where is Charlotte May? Is that enough to arrest Miss Downs? I believe so, yes. Oh, then shit. I think I've heard just about all I need to. Catherine, may I have a word? Maybe she's telling the truth and she really didn't take Charlotte. Maybe there's someone else. I don't think any of the rest ones had anything to do with it. So maybe it's someone... <sighs> looks like you were onto something after all. Yes, it looks that way. Mm. Let's wrap this up then, shall we? Wait a moment. You see now what I was doing. What I had to do. I do. Well, then, what's wrong? With a little more time, Shirley will tell us where Charlotte May is. You can arrest her. This is a good thing. Yeah, but you intruded, so... Yeah. You betrayed my trust after you promised me. I'm so glad that you were right. I, I really am, but... That doesn't change how you did it. Yeah. We did it. You and I. I listened to what you said, and... I truly am sorry. There were moments where I knew I was crossing a line, but I did it. You've told me already. And I meant it. 
Please. I'm going to update Mr. Morgan later on and tell him what we found. It would mean a lot to me if you were by my side. What do you say? I don't think so, Dad. Oh, shit. Sure. I'm sorry. Catherine, please. Did he do He's something? Dead. He really, she really I'm doesn't like you him. On suspicion of the abduction of Charlotte May Morgan and an attempt to obstruct an active and ongoing police investigation. And on the Polish, think, like evidence room, we found out, um, not the evidence room, the suspect room, we found out that, like, she had said some bad things about him. So, what, what the hell? Why she hates him so much? Shirley has confessed to almost everything I've thrown to them. Yeah, but... but... she's refused to give me the location of Charlotte May. I hope to God she's still alive. It's out of my hands and up to Catherine now. I've reached the end of my investigation. What about the bruise? You didn't give it to her. At what cost? Still missing six hours later. What? What six hours I after the Mr. dog? Morgan I'd return this brooch when I found Charlotte May. The mm. news of Shelley's arrest will have to do for now. Hmm. Now that all's said and done, suppose I should tidy all this away. They were all innocent. Everyone apart from Shirley. How did she manage to hide who she really was from everyone? Even her sister. What's that? I was hoping to return to Mr. Morgan with his daughter. Mm. Not this hollow gesture. What the fuck was that? Did you saw that? Or was it just me? What the fuck? Oh my god, it was this one. Jesus. Such a small courtyard. It looks like his home. I wonder if Theodore will stay with Annabelle. He knows the truth? I doubt my presence has helped their relationship. Uh, I'm not here to reminisce. She cheated on him. Approach. It's not your fault. Okay, so I'm gonna go. What if it's not here? I mean, she did what she did, yeah. But what if she actually wasn't the one who kidnapped? Um, Charlotte. And wonder what kind of neighbors lived around. Now I know all too well. I don't know. How will Mr. Morgan take the news, I wonder? Whee! He's been through enough. After talking with Shirley, it all started to make sense. She confessed almost everything. Her worst trait is her stubbornness and refusal to tell me where Charlotte May is. Hmm. Whee! 
<laughs> no sign of Catherine. She's not coming. Hello, Mr. Conway. Mr. Morgan, how are you? Uh, as well as can be expected, I suppose. I have to say, I wasn't expecting you so soon. I apologize. I, I thought you might want an update regarding Shirley Downs. Of course, yes. Uh, uh, why don't you step inside for a moment and, uh, well, please come in. You can leave your things down there if you like. What is his wife? Uh, Why is he never there? Ugh. You think that's a good idea? Please. You were saying? Uh, yes. In short, it went well. She confessed. Oh, uh, well... Uh, not to all of it, but I have reason to believe she's confessing right now in police custody. Mm. She confessed to hitting you over the head and to pretending she was attacked. We found the weapon and, well, the list goes on. What about my daughter? She refused to admit it. She was adamant. Maybe she's not... You said she confessed to hitting me. Well, there's more to the story, I'm afraid. She swears blind that she thought she was hitting Harold Levy. What? Uh, uh, okay, I, I don't know what that means. <laughs> I agree. It doesn't make any sense. Where is my daughter, Mr. Conway? Mr. Morgan. I won't stop until I find her. I, I'm sorry. That was unfair of me. I understand. And it's me who has to apologize. I, I told you I would find your daughter, and until now I've failed you in that matter. I don't blame you. you you've done all you can. I'm sorry. Where are my manners? Please, come and sit through here. Where is your wife, dude? Why is she nowhere? Perhaps you'd like a cup of tea, Mr. Conway. It's two sugars, isn't it? Uh, yes, that's right. Please, How? Make yourself at home. I'll be back momentarily. Uh, thank you, uh, I will. Oh, no! It's him! What? Did he do it? How does he know? How long have you lived in Daily View? must have been before I moved here. Uh, yes. Uh, about four years or so. <laughs> I remember the day you moved here. I should have introduced myself then. I, I'm sorry about that. Not to worry. I should have done the same. That's a very long story, I'm afraid. What about yourself? Isn't there a Mrs. Conway? Well, that's an even longer story. What exactly is your line of work? I'm a dentist. Really? I imagine that pays a good wage. Well, I'm a dental assistant, if I'm being honest with you, but I'm oh, training um, to that be reminds me. I brought so the brooch back. Mm. Interesting. Thank you so much. I hope it was of some use. What on earth? This isn't Charlotte May. It's a different girl altogether. Wearing Charlotte May's brooch. Another girl. Jesus, what is this? Mr. Morgan, what have you done? Oh my god. <clears throat> um, I said I hope the brooch was of some use. Uh, yes. I, I mean, no. I, I wasn't able to connect it to anything. Oh, shit. Is everything okay, Mr. Conway? You seem a little out of sorts. Yes, uh, I'm fine. Uh, 
I, uh... Oh, shit. Don't think I'll have that tea after all. I'm sorry to put you out, but I remembered I have to hand over all of my findings to What you. the fuck? She'll probably be waiting for me. She was six when that picture was taken. Is that so? Hmm. Such an innocent age, wouldn't you say? What the hell? Charlotte wouldn't have known what real danger was back then. Not like you and I. Well, we all have to grow up at some point. Oh, you'll excuse Is me. Is he taking girls really until the age of six and then kills them? I can't help but feel your discomfort. Is it something I have Oh, like shit. Like I said, I'm probably keeping He knows. Waiting. Here's all. He knows. He's gonna see the picture. Oh no. He's gonna kill me. He's gonna take that. You know, I thought that I was careful enough. But the Fuck. way you think. You really are very clever, Mr. Conway. Holy shit! No! It's funny. I, I spent the past few days wondering who on earth would attack me. I was as confused as everyone else. Turns out it was all just a misunderstanding. Have you ever heard anything so unlikely? I was going to leave town that night. I'd left her in Doe's basement. Things were almost in place. I was putting the rubbish out, and then... <laughs> well... And then Shirley Downs. She's still alive, isn't she? I really am glad you decided to investigate. The mystery was eating me up inside. You know, I watched you work these past few days. Watched as you pulled our neighbors' lives apart piece by piece. Getting to work with you at Shirley's pub and seeing you before that at Lady Doe's house. It was very exciting. Fuck. Go. It's funny, I, I felt that if I could just reach out. Fuck. Of course, I couldn't. From what I remember, you reached out with your fist. You almost caught me that night, you know, in Lady Doa's basement. You were so close, but still so far. You like now? You know, I've <laughs> never had to go back and check before. But after you promised me you'd find her, I had to think on my feet. She cried when she saw me. I suppose she was seeing me for the first time in many ways. She? You mean the girl that uh, some other poor child you'd taken? Yeah. Is she still alive, the girl? Why did you do this? Charlotte May was six when she... Mm -hmm. You see, after so many years... Well, they stop looking like children, don't they? What? So she was too old to remind you of the real Charlotte May. And that's why... This really isn't your first time. The first time I did this, my hands were shaking. I was a mess, Mr. Conway. I'd have been embarrassed just to be in your presence. You sound as though she means nothing to you. 
she means everything to me. Have you lost your mind? I think our little talk is over, Mr. Conway. What the fuck? Believe me, I don't want to do this, but you leave me no choice. No, you have other choice. I don't think you will kill me. You didn't tie that little girl up for no reason. If you were simply a murderer, you wouldn't have left her alive down there. There has to be something more to you. What makes you so sure? I... I think you wanted to see her as Charlotte May. You wanted to believe it right up until the end. Well, you've got it all figured out, haven't you? What happened to the real Charlotte May? You have a daughter, Mr. Conway. You know how it is. It's your responsibility. Your duty to protect them, no matter what. What happened? I must have left the balcony door unlocked. <gasps> I took my eyes off her for just a second. Holy shit. I lived on the fifth floor. Oh my Tell god. Me. I'm so sorry. Perhaps we should talk about it. You can tell me about her. If you let me go, I'm sure... I don't I think so, Mr. Conway. I've complimented you on your intellectual prowess. Please don't insult mine. Fine. Where is the girl now? She's quite safe. So he's just going and abducting Gertz? What do you think? Mr. Morgan, at least tell me, what's the girl's real name? Sophie Marling, if I recall. It was all over the papers, although I tried not to look. Funny. It made the front page for a week. One week, Mr. Conway. Then I think some football team won a game somewhere and the world <laughs> moved on. Of course. Makes you think, doesn't it? What would the real Charlotte may think of you? You won't speak her name again. Do you think she'd be proud of what you've done? Please. Stop. What about this girl? Everyone's looking for her. You can't get away with this. Mr. Conway. You've already arrested Shirley. No one is going to find her. And no one is going to find you. What the fuck? Now, please stop. You're beginning to make me rather uncomfortable. Jesus. You wouldn't want her to remember you this way. None of that matters. Now, please. Try to keep still. Oi! <laughs> Please, don't do this. You're a reasonable man, Mr. Morgan. No, he's I not. I you don't want to do this. Believe me, I've tried to change what I am, but I can't. Yes! Mr. Mr. Morgan. Oh. I would very much like to speak with you. Oh, for God's sake. Fuck. A word, Mr. Conway. Shit. The easier. Should kick in shortly. Start shouting, dude. Ah, hello, Mr. Morgan. I'm sorry to trouble you, but I wondered if I might speak with you and my father. It's him, Your father. It's him. Are you expecting him? I thought he might oh, already Mr. Morgan, be here. Stop. He said he was going to talk to you about Shirley Down. Please don't hurt her. May I come in and talk through our options? Catherine, run away. I'm not sure that's a good idea. Okay, uh, that's fine. I, I can come back tomorrow. Me. You know what? With everything that's Save going yourself. on, I'm not. Yes. I think that would be a good yeah. idea. Help. Um, tomorrow morning, lunchtime, perhaps. Oh. If you Shh. think it can wait until then, I'm sorry to bother you so late. P please don't apologize. We'll talk tomorrow. Right. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Shit, just take the Wait. wheelchair. What is it? If you haven't seen my father, he's stuck. His <laughs> and his bag. Uh huh. Mr. Morgan? <laughs> yes. Oh, 
Oh shit. Go. Oh shit. Ah. Go. That hurts. Oh shit. No. Ow. I did all this for nothing. <laughs> Jesus. So. What the hell? And it's a lot of girls that he was abducting. How many? Was he killing them after? When they stopped looking like his Charlotte? Holy shit, what? Ambulance, okay. Oh. Tony Morgan's arrest, six hours later. Six oh. hours later. Hello, dude. Do you know where Catherine is? Thanks. Ah, it's okay. Catherine. Dad, are you okay? I'm <laughs> fine. Oh my God. God you are. Sis. See, he did, he, he did here a lot. I did too. What happened here? I, I mean, what sort I of earth did no, I walk was into? just looking like that. If I'm honest, I'm still trying to figure that out myself. Shirley was telling the truth. Yeah. It appears so. We searched the house. We'd ruled him out. Is he? No, he's alive. He's been taken to the station. We want to know if he's done this before. Yes, he I'm has. I'm afraid you won't like the answer. Oh my God! It could have been you. It could have been either one of us. Dad, listen. I. No, Catherine. I'm sorry. I am too. It's funny, I... I came back tonight because... Part of me knew I should have listened to you. I just wanted to prove to myself that I didn't need any help. The apple hasn't fallen far from the tree. I need to ask. Did you find Charlotte May? Is she... Follow me. Oh, oh shit. She's okay. <gasps> She's there. Charlotte. Oh. This man is Robert Conway. He's been looking for you for days. Oh. Are you okay, my dear? You're safe now. You don't need to be scared anymore. Catherine here is going to take good care of you. I'll just be a moment. I'll come back. Don't worry. She doesn't look like Charlotte. She's blonde. First of all. But she, she's not Charlotte, of course. I'm just saying. That. She hasn't said a word since we found her. She thought that Tony Morgan was her real father. Fucking hell. She didn't even know that... It, it, uh... It doesn't bear thinking about. So, what do we do now? She doesn't have a home. She has. I hear name. Her real name is Sophie Marlin. You 
can look through the papers or make some calls for that name over the past few years. It's a great place to start. I imagine you'll want to come along and help. Uh, no, no. I, perhaps it's best to leave this up to the professionals. I'd oh. like it if you were by my side. Hmm? I'd like that too. Hmm. Okay, so he, the first time we talked to him on the first video, when he saw the brutes, he got really weird. So, but I, I just ruled it out as like um, someone who just seeing something from their kid. He, he, because he was looking weird at the start when I first talked to him. But after that, I didn't even thought about him, and I feel pretty stupid right now. But. Jeez, I feel really stupid right now that I didn't even thought about him because the thing is that at the start of the game it shows that the person is going up there and there is a man and a woman they are talking and then the baby gets abducted from the crib so it's a crib and you know it's a baby inside not a grown up girl and I've said that at the start that this is very weird, and plus there was rope. Why, why would you bind a baby? And then it started looking out weirdly because then he was out and he was throwing the garbage, even though he wasn't throwing the garbage. At the start of the video, at the start of the game, there was a baby in the crib and then the woman, the wife, was going upstairs to check on the kid. And then the husband was telling her, no, you don't have to check up on her every, like, two minutes. So, there were two people. And after that, you never see the wife. So, there are no two people, it's just the husband. The Morgan guy. And, plus, it wasn't a baby. It was a six-year-old, seven-year-old, however old she is. It's just so many stuff. That after looking back at them, I feel just stupid because I, I thought that they were weird when I was reading them and I was like, what, what the fuck? But I thought maybe they did something with the game and that it was just something different. That, I don't know. I thought it was just the game like that. So yeah, that was stupid. But the game was amazing. I loved it so much. I really liked it. And I was actually surprised when I learned that like, he he's the basically a kidnapper and killer as well because I think the previous children once they were growing too old he was just killing them apparently and yeah even though certainly certainly I knew that it wasn't her who kidnapped the, the child from the start I didn't think like from the start that like we've gone to her place not from the whole game that from the start that we've gone to her place and then he was pounding all this stuff. Plus that he was saying there were two people, but then probably they were saying that it was footprints of two people because Shirley and Morgan. Thank you for playing. Thank you for making the game. So yeah, basically there were probably two people because it was Morgan and then it was Shirley who he did Morgan and everything. She, I knew she wasn't the one who kidnapped it, uh, Charlotte. Maybe she had something to do with the whole like thing, but she wasn't a kidnapper. She's lots of things, but she wasn't a kidnapper. She's a liar, she's a thief, she's all of those things, but not not that. But oh my god, that was so freaking good. This was so nice. I I loved it. I really wish I would have playing, played it sooner. Such an interesting game, so good, very well made. I really liked every chapter. Yeah, that was it. That's the end of the series. That's the end of the disappearing Italia of you. And Conway and everything. So yeah. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the game. As much as I did. And I hope to see you all in the next video.